Hi, I'm Sean and welcome to This Tech. Today we're going to be reviewing the Ordkey FM wireless transmitter, which is a Bluetooth one, for your car. I've not used this product as yet, but I'm going to unbox it for you now, and later in this video we'll go down and review it and see how it works. Okay, so this is the Ordkey FM Bluetooth transmitter that I've purchased from Amazon. Right, let's have a look in the box. So we have the user guide in six languages. The warranty card. The USB to car cigarette lighter adapter. and the device itself. It's such a small device, just four centimeters in size. And attached to the back is its magnetized mounting plate, which has a 3M adhesive sticky pad for mounting it. The magnet is nice and strong, which has a nice satisfying snap into place. It has a one meter USB power cable. This was okay for my testing, but it may be a bit short for other people's needs. It comes with its own two port USB adapter, which is rated at five volts and 2.5 amps per port. Once it powers on, you can set the frequency by holding the top left button, then using the bottom left and right buttons to jump up and down by 0.1. Connecting it to your device is really simple. Just go to the Bluetooth menu on the settings of your device. Then you will see listed the OK BTF4. Just click on the device to connect. And then you will see it's listed as connected for phone and media audio. Now let's have a look at it in the car itself. Okay, so we're now in the car and I've installed the Orkey FM transmitter on the dashboard. Um, and then we're gonna go ahead and see it, see it actually working. Okay, as you see, I've installed the FM transmitter on the dashboard. Here it runs down and then we have that going into the USB adapter for it, into the cigarette lighter. So let's turn on the ignition and we'll see what happens. Now you can see here that I've set the frequency to 90 megahertz and then on the radio in the car itself we'll just go ahead and we'll tune that in so we have the 90 megahertz the same at the moment there's nothing playing so I've got my tablet next to me with some music on if I just press the first track
Now on the device itself, you can press ahead and press next track and it will skip straight away to the next track. As you can hear, the sound quality is really good. You can restart the track by pressing the left hand button button. Or if you press that twice, it will skip to the previous track. Now, I'm not sure how well the audio will come through on the recording, but it's absolutely crystal clear. And unlike on some other FM transmitters that I have used in the past, it doesn't seem to have any background noise or hiss when from, from other device, from other passing cars or from other radio stations. It seems to be very clear. And then you can use the top right button and that will um, pause your track and again to resume. Okay, so now we've tried it with music, now let's try it as a hands-free kit. So I'm just going to bring my partner and see if the sound quality sounds okay. Hi, I'm just testing this car kit. Just wanted to see if you can hear me okay? Yeah, I can hear loud and clear. Brilliant, that's great. Speak to you later. Okay, bye. Bye, bye. So the sound quality is really good. I'm quite impressed with them. Okay, it's a little test. We've been starting the car. We tried it with a bit of music. Showed you how we're skipping back and forth tracks. Uh, I didn't mention before, but you can use the top right button here to answer and finish your calls. Um, and the left button here is, is missing for turning on off the Bluetooth feature and rebinding it to other devices. You can have two um, mobile phones attached to it at the same time. So you have you and your partner can both have your phones attached, both play music, or obviously both take calls on the um, on the on the on the hands free. Um, so that's about it. Really like it. I really recommend it. Well, that was the unboxing and my review of the Ord Key Bluetooth wireless transmitter for your car. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up and like it if you liked it. And also hit subscribe if you would like to see further videos like this. And if you'd like to support the channel other ways, have a look in the video description and you'll find other ways you can help support me on my channel. Thank you.